Deathly Hollows Part 2 is a fantastic finish for the saga of Harry Potter. Here it is. Nicholas Flamel is the only known maker of the Sorcerer's Stone. The, the what? what? Oh, honestly, don't you two read? Cut. Great work, guys. <clears throat> I just sound like watching myself. I sound like I'm on helium, if we're being honest, you know. Yeah, it's kind of like your baby pictures being kind of like posted up around the world on like a 20 foot screen. So it's cool in a way, but also kind of slightly embarrassing. Uh, it makes me squirm a bit, to be honest. But um, yeah, it's funny looking back how different we all look. Suddenly I'm 23 this year and I really don't feel 23. I, it's, it's very strange kind of always having a, a reference of these, these films. You can kind of see all the awkward stages of growth. Yeah, it, it, it's quite a unique thing, I think, kind of growing up in this world. The three young stars, especially Radcliffe, found fame beyond their wildest dreams. I try not to think about it too much. Um, I just get on with it. What don't people understand about what you what you go through? I, I don't, I really, it's an incredibly good question. If I could answer that, I'd be a terribly successful child psychologist. Um, so I, I, really, I really don't know the answer to that question, to be honest. Being successful doesn't uh, make you immune to teenage Oh, ends. no, not at all. No, 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 I think everyone's as, as vulnerable to that kind of thing as everybody else is, yeah. Daniel recently confessed to British GQ that the heat of celebrity took its toll. Alcohol became a crutch, but his co-stars are defending him. I'm not sure. I'm quite suspicious. I don't know. It's, um... it's something that I think has been, been blown out of proportion, I think. I'm not sure if this has been kind of exaggerated. It, it's, I think it's been almost a misquote, and it's been you know, really taken out of out of context. No, I, I, was, I was, yeah, I wasn't really aware of it. That was never something that was obviously on set. Yeah, I think it's, uh, I, you know, I've been out with him on many occasions and I've never seen him, you know, in a damaging state at all. And yeah, it, it does feel like people are just waiting and um, waiting for us to kind of fall into that stereotype um, of that kind of child, child actor. Um, and just, yeah, just go crazy, which, um, yeah, which hasn't happened. Tell them how it happened that night. How you looked him in the eye. A man who trusted you and killed him. I never wanted any of you to die for me. You'll stay with me. Always. Until the end. No!